this so you can open up a different scene or you can close it up so hey loves and welcome back again to my channel it's good to have you here again we are back again with hacks and tips that will help you create amazing content now in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys two ways on how you can create your own background set your own backdrop sets on a budget now if you are interested then you definitely do want to keep on watching all right so now let's get started just in case you guys are seeing me for the first time hi i'm kilechin bona and i love coming up with content like this tricks like this hacks like this that are very budget friendly beginner friendly at the same time that will help you start creating amazing content irrespective of your budget your space your room the equipment you have i want to help you maximize whatever you have going on right now so in case you guys are seeing me for the first time i really appreciate it if you can stick around with me by subscribing to my channel now moving on to why you are here in case you guys haven't watched this video definitely feel free to watch this is the part one of hanging your back background on a budget and I show you how you can do that on your wall I usually film in front of this wall here however because I have changed my filming setup I don't have a wall to work with and everywhere is pretty much busy so I kind of need to create my own DIY set so for the first setup what I'm going to be needing is this okay so i got this as a reflector it came in a five in one reflector and this is what i use in diffusing however as you guys can see it has like a white soft diffusion over here you can also use this as a backdrop again you have to know how to maximize what you already have so if you're someone who has this lying around your living room your filming room and you want to so like use it to create your own background what you can do is you can literally just hang this up that's it if you guys want to have like a seamless background what you can do is to get an external um light and basically shine that light behind it this is the after and this is the before so it's going to make the background look really bright all right so this is what my background is looking like right now you guys wouldn't even know that there is a struggle going on behind me now because this is hanging up this is hanging off my um ceiling it might tend to move a bit if i turn off the lights behind me you guys will see that there's a huge difference it's going to look dull and not as bright as it is right now so in case you guys don't have that reflector you don't have that diffuser over there um something else you can do is to get a very affordable fabric whatever color you want to use but still going to be hanging because again we don't have an empty wall to kind of use except you want to move things around if you do want to move things around or if you have an empty wall a plain wall then definitely click on this link right here i'll show you guys how to make it work with that but with this i'm just going to be using the space above me <laughs> and around here to also make it work number two is to just hang it using the same hook that we use in case you guys not know yet i'm a hook girl i believe that you can do so many things just by using hooks and they are so inexpensive and i have them oh, all over my studio so i'm just going to hang this over here i do have one hook here so i can and we have one done i have one two three hooks over here and i have one there the tiny hole to actually make it work there we go there we go and there we go we have this hanging backdrop well, the cool thing about this is that you can easily divide hide um cover up your filming environment using this so you can open up a different scene or you can close it up you can divide your filming room using this you can make this your filming instagram um, section then this side could be your youtube sector which is what i'm currently trying to do so yeah um this is definitely something that comes in handy again this is what it looks like and this wouldn't cost you anything just hooks hang it on your ceiling if you don't have anywhere to hang it on your wall this is something you can do this is how close i am to it like one step 
away from it I can definitely make you work by doing something like this so don't give up give it a try and uh, honestly thank me later this is the best thing i could have possibly done and yeah i wanted you guys to be able to always make it work on a budget especially if you're a beginner so this is what my 50 mm lens looks like so if i wanted to film like a pretty tutorial um this could definitely work so this is one scene and then this is a totally different thing happening behind us so this is my background but then this is the background that we're trying to create in this video so this is what a different background looks like basically um it's kind of moving around just because of my ac is literally blowing on it that's why definitely change your background change the backdrops and add something different add something new to it without spending so much if you guys want to see my entire background collection let me know down in the comment section oh i'm gonna roll but if you guys enjoy this video let me also know down in the comment section as well i love creating content like this if you guys are new here feel free to subscribe by clicking on this button right here and also check out the previous video on how to hang a backdrop on your wall right here and as well as just get started with creating amazing backgrounds amazing backdrops right here again feel free to check out all these videos as well and i'll definitely see you guys in one of these videos also subscribe it's free and yeah let's go